Hello and welcome you all to this session of program programming of PIC 18F4550 through the MPLAB IDE. We will write a program for LED blinking. So for writing the program of LED blinking, we will select the MPLAB IDE by clicking on the icon MPLAB IDE and we will get this two windows in a particular window and uh, th these are the win window workspace and output windows these two windows are present now we will select our project and then clicking on the project wizard we get the wizard and clicking on the next we will select the pick series we will have a, a number of series of this pick microcontroller we will select the pick 18 f4550 and click on the next button what we we'll see that uh, we have to choose this microchip C18 tool suit and under it it is various its its various contents are present we can see that we have red cross marks on it this shows that these files have not been included so we will have to include it by selecting this and pressing on the browse button MPSM, MPASM win, open. This cross has been deleted. Next one, browse. Bin. MP link, open the same process happens with it the next one MCC 18 open MPLib open now we see that whole of the cross mark has been deleted now check this button and next now we have to name the R project we will name it as LED underscore B L I N K I N G one then browse we will have to make a particular folder in which the project has to be saved we will have a folder named as ZZZ select it and save it sorry we have to give the file name file name is LED simply LED save we click on next button and this wizard has to be skipped and finish what do we see the same two windows has been opened output window is same but the pro the workspace is contained with too many folders that is source file folder header file folder object file folder library file folder linker script other files now we will have to add header file by clicking right on it add files click on the header file open this has been included then click on the right click on the linker file then select it then open now both of the files have been included now we will have to click on the new file where we have to write the codes we will write the code of LED blinking we have written this code has include build auto dot h this is the header file 
this is the header file that says the compiler that we have to include whatever the functions or the whatever the libraries whatever the libraries that are defined in this header file now the void main void main shows that the program execution will start from here in i we have taken arbitrary constant i after that here actually we have to we have to take four leds and with the help of four pins of port b we will allow them to blink now to allow them to blink we will have to make each port as output port because we have to give them signals with respect to microcontroller so and uh, this is a facility in uh, pic 18f4550 that each pin can be programmed now with the help of this command trace b bits dot trace b b0 actually we have taken chosen here b0 that is uh, port number b port number b and its pin is zero number pin we have given all the four pins as zero because we will have to make all the pins as output port this is done with the help of trace b bits dot trace b b0 b1 b2 and b3 now we will provide different values to all the four pins of port b through the help of port b bits dot rb0 equal to 1 port b bits dot rb1 is equal to 0 port b bits dot rb2 is equal to 1 and uh, similarly this one equal to 0 now this will make the pin the led connected to zero number pin as of this will make uh, pin number 1 as a 0 and with this will make the second LED to be glowed after that pin number pin number 2 as 1 and this will make the LED number 3 off and LED number 4 will on as it is as 0 is applied to this 0 means on and 1 means off 2 for the LEDs here all digital all IP digital this means that the, all the processing will be in digital this is a function and uh, we have used here a loop for i is equal to 0 i is less than equal to 8 i plus plus and under this we have given all the four pins different values than the earlier that is pin uh, pin number 0 is given 0 here instead of 1 pin number 1 is given 1 instead of 0 here pin number 2 is given 0 instead of 1 and pin number 3 is given 1 instead of 0 and this is repeated 8 times and uh, we will see the difference between this and this and uh, th we will see that the LED is actually blinking the program is completed now we will have to save this by clicking on the save icon we will save this we will have to name the file we will name it as LED ZZZ and we will have also to mention the extension that is .c because it is C file and click on the save button now the color we can see that the color of the programs has been changed that is blue black and green now the program has been saved and we will have to include this program under the source file folder so right click on it select the add files select the LED ZZZ and press on the open button now we can see that this file has been included in the source file now what we do we will have to build it so we will see that on running it how does it happens or what does it happens and uh, it works properly or not is it co it's the code that we have written is right or not so we come we will compile it by pressing this button 
and see what happens actually it is taking time and processing if error will be there it will show the error and if the error is not present it will be built successfully so it is uh, writing the result here we, we can see that error is 0 and error is 0 and build successfully this means that our code is free of error and uh, we can it is ready to be burned into microcontroller that is all about of uh, the LED blinking program that is uh, to sign off thank you